Okay, so today um, I'm not doing a review so much on my BioLite stove. Uh, what I want to briefly talk about is my charging system for when I'm out, uh, out camping, hiking, for extended periods of time. Um, if you know anything about the BioLite stove, it has the ability to uh, recharge small USB devices. It does not do it quickly, and you're probably going to have to sit in front of this and feed it wood for quite a bit of time to fully charge something. But if you're just looking, let's say for example you have a cell phone, it's an emergency, the cell phone's dead, you need to make a call, this bad boy will probably give you 10% battery power and maybe about 40 minutes of charging. Uh, you know, that's your emergency phone call. But anyways, this is the main part of my charging system because it uses a bioelectric generator. You feed wood into it when it produces enough power to, uh, it, there's a lithium, um, lithium battery inside of this that runs a fan that keeps the uh, flames going, feeds the fire uh, oxygen. But when it produces enough power, a green light turns on the front letting you know that you can plug in USB, de USB devices uh, such as, you know, your mp3 player if you need to listen to music there's a radio built into this one or if you um, have a speaker a little fancy speaker like I do these are great by the way uh, this is rechargeable and has a built-in lithium-ion battery and produces great sound um, I also take with me a battery pack charging station basically it's lithium ion powered and I can plug USB devices into this to charge stuff as well inside of this are two 18650 lithium ion batteries let's just see if I can pop this guy open there you have it and I can charge two items from it because there's two, two USB spots. Now, what happens when these batteries die? Well, I haven't tested this, but, you know, theoretically, I could plug in this uh, USB cord and then plug it into the BioLite stove. Gosh, hold on plug it into the BioLite stove and recharge my lithium ion batteries. If I'm out in the woods and I'm going to be out there for quite a while and I kill these batteries or wear them down, I probably could charge them on this and I'm sure it would take a long time. But if I'm in the woods, I'm sitting in front of the fire, that's all I have is time. Unless it's an emergency situation. My headlamp runs on one of these bad boys here, so I can recharge them and then pop it back into my headlamp. So this is my basic charging system for when I'm out uh, camping. I have yet, to be honest, I have yet to test recharging the lithium ion batteries using the BioLite stove. I have successfully recharged this uh, lithium powered speaker that I often during the day or evening I'll plug the mp3 player into it and it uh, it didn't take all that long to recharge this but my next uh, I guess video will be uh, taking two dead 18650 batteries and plugging them in and, and see how long it takes to recharge them. At some point, since I'm a gadget dude as well, love my toys, man, uh, I want to add a solar panel setup to this whole system. Um, still doing some research on that, what's going to work, but, uh, but that's just a matter of time before I, I go in that direction. But anyways, this is what, what I have right now and uh, like I said next time I will do a video on recharging these guys using using the BioLite. Anyways thanks for watching and happy hiking.